Under the Obama administration, we have sent tens of thousands of more troops into Afghanistan, all while the same network exposed in the Iran-Contra affair discussed earlier controls the opium trade. It was revealed in October of 2009 that the CIA had been funding puppet Afghani leader Amid Karzai's warlord brother for the last eight years. He is the lead opium dealer in the region. It seems the same cartel that was dealing drugs in the 80s and 90s never stopped. After all, how else could the government fund black operation programs across the board? The Karzai regime has whole sections of it which are drug supported and uh, we can't touch it. We turned Afghanistan into the major supplier of heroin for the world. It happened under CIA supervision. This continues while many of the Taliban are literally on U.S. payrolls. Is there a possibility that we have Taliban employees? Uh, the commander in the field, or the, I should say the uh, COCOM commander, General Petraeus, has made it a conscious effort to, uh, as part of his coin strategy, to hire local nationals. Uh, I can't talk in this in this form, nor am I the qualified guy to talk about it, but uh, there is no doubt in my mind, one day you're on one side of the ledger, the other day you may be on the other side of the ledger.